where did that like word association sort of uh, scheme heavy style come from though? Because that's almost become the new standard nowadays for a lot of guys playing off that. Yeah, I mean it's it's, it's become super popular over the past you know two three years. Um, I definitely wasn't the first to uh, rap this way. Um, however, I do think I had a huge hand in popularizing it. You know, through my my battle with JC. Uh, which I think a lot of up-and-comers at the time definitely studied and kind of influenced their own style. And there are a lot of veterans, too. You know, there's a lot of veterans who I spoke to after the JC battle who definitely told me that hearing the way I put words together influenced them to try new things. You know, they, they might not be directly scheming, but it definitely influenced them to try more wordplay or different wordplay or different ideas with wordplay. So, um, you know, I don't think I get a, a huge uh, respect for the amount of influence um, that my style in particular has had over veterans and, and newcomers alike. Uh, but it's definitely there. And if, you know, if you pay attention, if you look at how people's, uh, rhyme structures and things have changed since after the JC battle or even after my debut battle on URL. Um, if you look close enough, you'll notice um, a, lot of, a lot of people definitely do things different uh, because of me. So hopefully, you know, when it's all said and done and I quit Battle Rap for Good and the history books and the Hall of Fames get written, I hope I find a spot in there somewhere <laughs> for my influence. Yeah, I get what you mean, man. That's interesting, though. You, do you feel like people? You feel like you feel people aren't giving you enough credit for that style right now, or do you think maybe in like a few years when people can kind of look at it, it's like, oh yeah, he actually was very influential. Do you think it's kind of like people hating on you a little bit? Um, I won't say it's hate as much as I'll say it's ignorance. Um, you know, I, I don't think it's a hate thing at all, but I, but I do think that it's severely overlooked. Um, you know, I I think. There's very few people who have had as much influence as I have. Um, you know, the source obviously I would say has had the most influence over people over the years in terms of rapping. You know, uh, I would go as far as to also say Loaded Lux, uh, you know, maybe QP from the West Coast, uh, you know, and, and maybe one or two other people, you know, but, but alongside them, um, you know, I, I think my name has to be in the conversation just because of, you know, I think we're, we're kind of nearing the end of it, but you know, I would say between 2013 and, you know, maybe up to a few months ago, I had most newcomers, most URL proven grounds guys, most king of the dot ground zero guys, most, um, most people. <laughs> trying to rap a certain way and trying to, to do schemes and associated wordplay a certain way and, and even the veterans who have been around, even the Tay Rocks, the Cortezes, the uh, you know, a lot a lot of people who were around even before me um have rapped a little bit different since you know, since I came around. So um I definitely think it's been overlooked. You know, I, I, I think a lot of people, a lot of people watching from afar have noticed, you know, like the, you know, like I said, Method Man, Joe Budden, King Lowe's, all I've had conversations with all these people where they have told me your influence over battle rap is clear. Like it's amazing. And that's what, that's where a lot of their respect level for me comes from. Um, but also, you know, I, I just think the average battle rap fan, you know, the fans who are maybe, just getting into battle rap or have just gotten into battle rap over the past year, I think it's tough for them to appreciate it because they don't necessarily know the history of the style. So when you come in, you know, within the past six months, within the past year, even within the past maybe two years, and you hear a hundred other battle rappers that sound just like me, and then you hear me, you know, it's probably tough to figure out where the style originated from. To them, I probably just sound like the rest of them. Nobody probably sounds like, <laughs> you know, they're ahead of the style or started the style. So they don't really have an appreciation for 
the fact that I've been doing this since 20, you know, in battle rap since 2011, in music since like 2006, I've been rapping the same way with this kind of wordplay, with these kind of schemes and this kind of style, whether it's over beat or acapella. Um, but like I said, you know, ho- hopefully over time, um, as trends switch in battle rap, as things change, as other things become popular and this becomes less popular, you know, hopefully people will look back and say, man, I remember that era the Chilla Jones era when everybody was trying to rap like him. You know what I mean? So we'll see what the history books tell us.